Hey, how's it going everybody? Clash here, welcome back for some more of Spore, and last time we were making our way towards the completion of the progress meter for the space stage, and that's what we're gonna keep doing this time as well. So, planet Ara whatever in the Ara La La star system, and then planet that place in that star system, and okay, we have a lot of artifacts here apparently to find, so let's go ahead and zoom out here, and try and figure out where all this stuff is. So, this is for the, what race is this? It's for the Flits, okay, are these the Flits over here? Yeah, it kind of looks like them. I can't really tell for sure. Are they? Yeah, I think that's them. Let's go ahead and go over here and then zoom in a bit. And actually, yeah, this is it. It says the uh, quest is like right over here. So, I imagine that the artifacts will all be... Actually, they give us like the arrows right over here, don't they? Is it four? Wait a minute. There are four little lines here, but there are three artifacts. How does that make sense? Huh. Well, that's weird. Let's go over here first. And it looks like some ass kickers are over here. Or Narnians, I'm not sure. Could be either one, but we'll check it out anyways. And then uh, we've also got some terraforming on that one, I think it's Green Spice Planet to do. We've got some terraforming to do over there. I think it's either Green Spice or Purple because I started colonizing that last time. But uh, what's going on over here? We need that artifact. So let's go ahead and use this radar. Oops. Turn that on. And it's not really helping me out here. It's not helping me find my objective or my item that I need. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It started going off there for a second. Here we go. Here's some progress. There we go. All right. We're hot on the trail here. Fantastic. I was about to say, if I have to just kind of roam around here until I magically happen upon this artifact, it'll be pretty annoying. But there you go. Go ahead and abduct that artifact. And now to space we go. And, yep, looks like the ass kickers are down here. Or actually, do they... Wait, wait a minute. Hold the phone here. Are they like a tribe or something at this point? They might be in the tribe. Yeah, they are, it looks like. Huh. How about that? They are sentient. Hmm. Well, looks like my other species that I made in a different uh, spore profile or whatever is doing all right. They're already in the tribal stage. And uh, I guess they're doing well for themselves. Hey, what the hell? Oh, no. These people are being attacked. All righty. Let's go ahead and help them out then. Not sure who's attacking them, but they have just made the worst mistake of their lives because, uh, you know, I'm, I'm me. We're the, we're the Narnians. We're like, we, there's no way that uh, we're going to lose to these guys. Whoever they may be, I don't know who they are, but they're screwed either way. So it looks like, uh, okay, I assume the yellow dots are the bad guys. Yep, that makes the most sense to me. Uh, what the? Okay, they're attacking like three different cities here. Um, well, that ship just died. Wow, these guys aren't, wow, <laughs> they got destroyed apparently. Okay, well, good job, Flit people. They kind of crushed uh, whoever was attacking them. I have no idea who that was, but... It looks like it was the Apox Empire, or at least that's what the uh, thing said down there. We won't have to worry about them for a while, that's good. Okay, can I make this? Yes, I can, and then over here, and perfect. Let's go ahead and get whatever uh, artifact is on this planet. It would be, wait a minute, which planet do we have? Oh, it's this planet right here. Alrighty, well, we're just going to go and fly down here and steal one of your guys' artifacts. Not a big deal. Don't mind us. Look at this poofy planet here. It's all gray and nasty. What is the point of that? Who would want to live here? Or set up a colony here? Hey, here we go. Go ahead and abduct that uh, artifact there. Come on. There you go. Choose a valid ground target. That's what I did, game. That's what I did. I did indeed do that. I better get some, like, progress on my progress meter for completing this quest, because this one is taking a w little while. I mean, it is just like a little fetch quest, but nevertheless, hopefully I can uh, achieve victory here. Get some progress on the progress meter. After doing this, uh, was this even the right planet? I think it may have been. All right, we'll just follow our radar, and hopefully this will lead us to victory here. Okay, radar, here you go. Yeah, looks like that's it. Sweet. There you go, abduction beam. My face itches. I don't know why. It's annoying when my face itches, or my nose itches, or my eye itches during a commentary. It's not my favorite thing ever. It's annoying, especially if I'm playing a game that's like action heavy, and if I take my hands off the controls, I'll die or something. But now I can just deliver these artifacts back to the, uh, the Flits, as they're called. It's kind of a weird name for a superior, advanced alien race or whatever, but I'm not here to judge. I'm not here to, uh, make fun of whatever name they've given themselves. Alrighty, in the name of the Grand Council, we greet you. Okay, shouldn't I have gotten some sort of reward for that? I guess I did, I can't really tell, but missions, clarification, blah blah wait a minute, what the hell? Did I do something wrong? You found all of them, now to deliver them... What the... Is, this isn't... Okay, that's Kavir. 
Homiza. Is that that other planet that he was pointing me towards over here? Uh, and yes, it was. Huh, it was like a collaborative quest or something. I don't even know. But here we go. Let's go ahead and go over here to Homiza. Homiza, how you pronounce that? And give them these artifacts. Alrighty. Uh, yes, I've come with a delivery. blah -de blah I'd like to do something else. Uh, let's do another mission, perhaps. I didn't get any progress for completing that. Hmm. Every time we try to talk to them, they start shooting. Hey, yeah, let's let's do this. The I don't know how to pronounce any of that. It's choked with urban blight. The inhabitants might be belligerent if they lived in nature. Blah blah. Uh, sounds like a larf. What? I don't even know. You can count on me. Whatever. Okay. Actually, can I sell something to you guys? Maybe you want to give me a lot of. Yeah. There we go. Give me all those spore bucks. There. Just take advantage of the fact that you guys don't have very many pink spice planets in your neighborhood and just rip you off. That's that's what I'm gonna do. But let's go over to Diorius. Actually, no, let's go to over to Ortiz first. Get whatever spice I can get from these guys and and take that back somewhere that I can sell it. And now let's go up here. Hopefully they have some green spice for me. Give me that green spice. You know I love that green spice. They haven't been making anything here. Did I not build anything? I probably didn't build any buildings or give them any factories or whatever. Yep, that makes sense to me. Okay, then. Let's go ahead and start building stuff. Uh, let's go with the factory. We're gonna make this very quick here. Hopefully, anyway. Uh, yeah, let's just make it like a giant ball. Like, the building's just gonna be like a giant sphere. That's all it is. Okay. Is that, like, right there in the middle? Okay, it looks like it. We'll go ahead and make it a little bit taller. It'll be like a cone or something. I don't know. And then this will be the roof. Why not? Yeah, look at that. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Looks like a, uh, a lantern or something. A very fat lantern. I don't know. That's the best way I can describe it. But then a door. How about... I don't even know if I've used this door before. And it's not going to work because of this stupid circular building. So yeah, that's why I don't like the circular buildings. It's hard to like put a door on them. We'll just use, use this hexagon thing. Whatever. Not a big deal. Alrighty. And then uh, we'll put another cone up here. How about if I use this? A top cap. Okay. Yeah, that'll do. It's fine with me. I don't care. It's gonna get any bigger. Can I, like, spread it out? Oh, wow. That looks stupid. I like it. It looks stupid, but I like it. Alrighty. Civics lesson. Now I can throw this door up here. And then make it taller. Okay. This is about the most ridiculous door or building I've ever made. Um, We'll just put, like, a propeller right there. Just because, you know, there's, there's no reason not to. I see no rules or regulations saying that I shouldn't do that. And that'll be fine. Uh... Let's go ahead and go over here, give it some sort of color uh, scheme. How about one that I haven't used before? How about like one of the ones later down here in the in the menu of things? Hey, how about this? Eh, I don't know. Maybe that. Maybe this. That doesn't look too bad. I don't really care. Let's just go ahead and make that. Uh, derp. I don't. I don't know. Check mark. Thank you very much. Let's go ahead and throw these factories down. Now we need a house though before we do that, then we can organize stuff accordingly. How about this nasty spiked house? There we go. No robbers will be hopping through the windows of this building. Otherwise, they'll get stabbed in the face by a spike. Alrighty. So, we'll just put this up there. Eh, that's like a tent or something. How about this? Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. Actually, let's keep it smaller, but make it tall. I don't even know why I'm messing with this. It doesn't even matter. It's not going to like change the attributes of the house or whatever. I don't even have to put a door there. I can just put like a window down or some shit. Uh, a pressure hatch. Okay. It's like a fallout vault or something. Oh, there we go. Well, that'll do. Actually, can I make this a little bit? Yeah, how about that? Ah, actually, never mind. It, like, spreads into the spikes. We don't want the spikes to be covered up. We don't want that at all. And then just like a random... How do you even... Just put it like up here on the roof or something? <laughs> no thanks. Um, A hive cover. Okay, no. A button. A donut. We can just put like a donut up there. Yeah, sure, whatever. Look at that. There's the donut. Just like a dumb, fat donut. Nah, never mind. I don't want that. Hey, an acorn. Okay, no. No, that'll be fine. That, that's just, that's fine the way it is. Poopy house. That's the name of our house. And then you over here. And let's make it like, ew. That's not what I thought it would look like. How about that? Yeah, that's fine. Looks like a medieval house almost. If that's what stuff looked like in the medieval times. I don't think they did, though. And holy crap, this stuff is expensive here. What are you doing to me, game? These are some expensive buildings. 
I think they've always been this expensive, but whatever. I don't care. It's it's still a pain in the butt either way. Alrighty, this will do. And ah, Terra score too low. Oh well, that'll do. Managed to get that done in a uh, decent amount of time. Add a building to upgrade your colony, etc., etc. Kaba, destroy or capture all the cities of the Flit Empire. Oh what? I didn't say it was the Flits. Are you kidding me? Wow. That's dumb. That doesn't make any sense to me. The Flit Empire and Planet Brazia, whatever. I don't understand. Hmm. Sure, capture... Yeah. Well, I guess we have no choice now if we want to... Actually, couldn't I just get rid of the mission? 600,000 spore bucks? Okay, never mind. We're not getting rid of this. That's a lot of money. All right, sorry, guys. Might have to go to war with you and fuck your shit up. Uh, it's unfortunate, I know, but this is like... I don't know. It, that's a lot of money just to capture one poopy city out here in the middle of nowhere. So let's go ahead and do this. Sorry, guys. I This wasn't supposed to happen, but oh, no. That was <laughs> a little bit overboard there. Conqueror 3. Well, we get some progress on the progress bar. I mean, why not? Let's go ahead and abduct this money. And, yeah, we're going to be rolling in spore bucks here. Yeah, that wasn't too bad at all. I think we should exterminate the flits if it means I can get more monies and stuff and more progress. We got our first bit of progress here in a while, so I'd say that's pretty good. All right, back to the this place, to these guys that I didn't really think they'd want me want me to fight the flits or whatever. It just doesn't that doesn't make sense to me, but whatever. Let's talk about something else, yeah, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Cool uh, trade. Can I? Ooh, I can sell this pink spice to you. Yeah, just keep on paying obscene amounts of money for my pink spice. It really doesn't matter to me. And the red spice as well. Okay. Now we've earned another badge and some more progress. Fantastic. Alrighty, we can buy something crazy now. How about that? I would like to buy something crazy. Medium cargo hold. Eh. Large health. Yes, I will take that. Give me that large health. Now we're doing okay in the way of health. That is pretty good. I have to say. Mini happy ray. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, wait a minute. Level terrain. Nah, I'm good. I don't think these guys have anything else at the moment. Nothing else at the moment that I really need. All right, I'm sorry, guys, but it's got to happen. I haven't conquered enough things lately, so why the hell not? Let's do it. Oh, they're attacking me. That's unfortunate. How unfortunate. Do you want to... Oh, no. Do not destroy that cargo. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Kavir planet. They're going to beat my ass. You watch. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, they're going to do some hefty damage here because they are a pretty tough bunch. They have a lot of cities on this planet. Man, that is kind of ridiculous, if I can be perfectly honest. But there goes that city. Alrighty. Um, did they throw up the flag? Yes, they did. Okay, let's stop attacking them. And who's attacking me? Let's just kill all of these guys here. So they can't provide me with any problems anymore. Ugh, I don't even know who I'm attacking. All right, so that guy, that guy, this guy. Okay, we're in good shape here. Who else? This guy? He wants some of this? Alrighty. Okay. A few more cities here. We have like ten more, it seems. And those turrets are going to be a pain in the butt here. Ugh. Just destroy the city before they can do more damage. There we go. Alright, we're in business. I think we're doing alright here. Okay. And there goes that city. On to the next one. There's one down here. I'm actually taking a decent amount of damage here for each fight, which is not good. I don't like that at all. I don't like taking dumb amounts of damage. But if it means progress, then I don't care at this point. I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and destroy these guys. That is a lot of spore bucks. Now we can definitely do some more terraforming here. Which is always nice, so... There's some losses to this. I mean, I'd rather not have to fight everything. I know I said earlier in the space stage that I wouldn't be doing all this damage and whatnot. I said that I'd evolved to a point beyond, you know, where I'd have to wage war and such, but... At this point, it's irrelevant to me. Can these guys get conquered already? There you go. Good job, team. Good job, indeed. We may be able to uh, beat them without having to make another trip. It's possible. I'm not sure, though. We'll have to see how things go. There's no ships on the radar except for that guy that's trying to catch up to me over there. So we'll see how this goes. I'm probably going to use all my energy up, though, before we can beat these guys. So do I just destroy the buildings? I imagine it's the buildings that have to go. Yeah, why not? If I aim at the buildings, maybe it'll take a little bit less time. Look at them. They're hunting me down. They're trying to do everything that they can. They're doing whatever they can possibly think of. But it's not going to work. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to win at the end of the day. 
That's just the way it goes. I'm sorry, guys, but, you know, things happen. Things occur in this world, and we just have to deal with them, and there goes that city. Looks like I destroyed their town hall. Maybe that's what it is. When I destroy the town hall, it just automatically ends them, pretty much. Look at this uh, cargo over here. Let's take it. Look at this money, and then that thing, too. I don't even know what that was. Uh, stealing objects from other planets can anger the local... I think I've already angered them. I think we're beyond that point. What else did I take from them? It was something weird. It Was it the blue spice? Really? That's all it was. I just took a blue spice. Okay. And there's another colony right here. Okay. That's that's great. They just got random colonies that are like, you know, a few meters away from each other. That makes sense. That's what I'd do if I was a master colonizer or whatever. And these little money caches. Oh, actually, they do give me a lot. I think that other one only gave me like 4,000 or something, though. What's up with that? And why did I change the map here? Um, three more towns to go. We're approaching our limit, though, here, in terms of energy. Ow, I just hit the mountain right there like a dumb, I think. Oh, well, what are you going to do? All right, sorry, guys. This is just the way it's got to go. It was not meant to go like this, but I started attacking you, and now there's no other way for things to happen. I've lost one of my allied ships. You'd think they would give up, you know? Like, you'd think they'd be like, all right, you've taken out, like, ten of our cities at this point. We might have to give up. We might have to give in. Hmm. I feel like there's more than just this city and the other one. I feel like there's more than... Actually, maybe not. Who knows? Because I destroyed a couple of them, so that kind of messed with the meters or whatever. So, yeah, I'm sure after this one, we'll probably be good to go. They'll surrender and whatnot. Oh! Oh, no. Only one allied ship left. But it doesn't matter, because we have conquered them. Capture system. Actually, let me get that money first. Give me the money. I'm, like, just about to run out of uh, energy and whatnot, too. And some blue spice. Why not? comes in the form of a box, apparently. So, capture system. Uh, we reluctantly conclude that it is hopeless to continue the fight. Yeah, I thought so. I claim this place. Yay! Now we have another colony. And we get to keep a whole bunch of cities as well. Uh, congratulations, etc., etc. Uh-huh. I get it. All right. And no progress on the progress meter. I could probably buy a star system and get some progress. I think I'll do things that way. But first... Oh, man. These guys have a lot of blue spice on their hands that they should get rid of. So first of all, let's go over there, and then go back over here, and then get that blue spice. And then over to the, uh, I forget what the name of that green spice planet was, but we'll go over there next. Yep. Go ahead and refuel over here. I'm sure it won't cost a whole lot, or at least it shouldn't. Okay, talk to you guys. Congratulations. Yep. Not that much at all. Trade. And they don't really care about my spice. Missions. You guys have any missions? Uh, harmless virus on planet that place has mutated into a threat to wildlife. Yes, I will do that. Uh-huh. Etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. Blah, blah, blah. Now I have to kill some random creatures that are infected with stuff. And uh, let's go over to over here. That's pretty convenient having little, like, marker, little arrow lines, whatever you want to call them. Little quest guider things. They, they help out a lot. So I don't have to wander around aimlessly trying to get to where it is I'm supposed to go. Sometimes you do have to do that, though. Sometimes it'll be like, oh, you have to go to this star that's within this distance from this place and blah -de blah Which isn't a big deal, but it can be annoying. So uh, let's go over to, Nar to Narnia and see what I can sell to them. Or at least collect some spice from them. They could probably be doing better in terms of making red spice. They really could, but oh my god. You can have all my yellow spice. And then... Um, What's that noise? Huh. Oh, it's like music or something. I thought it was like a random ticking sound, but whatever. I want to expand our empire. I would like to go to war. And they cannot do that. Wow. You guys suck at giving me objectives. You know that? You're like supposed to be the home colony and whatnot. You haven't given me any solid objectives here. And I have a problem with that, but go ahead and talk to them. Trade. And oh, man. That is a lot of money right there. Okay. Uh, goodbye. I don't know why they would pay that much for some pink spice. I mean, it's, I realize it's good, but... It can't be that good, right? It's just pink spice. Like, what are you gonna do with that? Well, I'm trying to think. Like, well, what can you do with all that spice? But whatever. I'm sure there's an answer somewhere that somebody has. And look at all that. Look at all that money. We, we have a lot of money here, I have to say. But let's go ahead and save... Because what I'm about to do next is uh, see if I can purchase a star system and get some progress that way. So, which star system do I want? 
I think I want the Jagoku's star system. Maybe they will be uh, willing to accept a kind of low ball price. Maybe a million? Maybe three million? I don't know. I make a lot at this point, so let's go with three million. This colossal sum is the epitome of generosity, and since you've got so much money, maybe you'd like to spend some of it in our Emporium. You're welcome. So we have just bought our first uh, star system. Congratulations to using the diplomatic means to form a strong trade alliance. You've been able to negotiate a sweet deal and purchase their system. I don't know if that was a sweet deal. Could have been better, but uh, yeah, and then red spice, really? That could be less poopy, but whatever. As long as I get progress. Yep, there's a badge right there. Congratulations, you have earned the title of the legendary. Haha. -ha. Look at that. That is fantastic. And we only have three more little chunks of progress to go, so... Didn't get that much done this episode, like in terms of length of progress, but we are getting there. I do want to wrap up this series uh, in a somewhat near future so I can start some new games that I want to do. But thank you for watching this episode of Spore. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave either a like or a comment, and uh, if you want, a combination of the two. It really helps me out a lot by letting me know that you're enjoying this series and that you want to see more. And uh, it also helps the channel grow, which is always fun. But uh, thanks again for watching. Remember that I love you all, and I will see you next time. Peace.